Monogram. Louis Monogram. What do all these things have in common? No, not Kanye's closet. But like him, they're trash. And tonight, Closed Down Investigates. Off-white. The legal that's very annoying these off-white. When I see them yellow belts, it makes me slow down and caution. And it, 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 it makes me think that the person is slow. Um, something's wrong about me. So, I'm slowing down. Like, what's the purpose? Like, it, it wraps around your waist, or your shoulder, or a dog tag, or a camera van, or whatever. It's like, it just looks crazy to me. Like, I don't, I don't, I don't understand why I gotta, why I gotta be something that screams from a block away. Ooh, look at me. I have, I'm cautioned. Hey, doing jumping jacks. Look at me. Look what I got on. Yes, off white. I'm killing them. No, kill yourself. Like, what's the sense? Like, you guys, tell me. Like, what, what, what's the sense? Like, why do you purchase that belt for? 300 plus dollars. Uh, that's why I take them off white. Belts. Shout out to Virgil though. <laughs> Slow down. I just wanna get to the that's my gen. How's my gen? Oh <clears throat> Well, there you have it folks. Straight from experts. They confirmed it. Off white belts are still trash. Moving on. Our next story. Gucci, Louis, Fendi monogram. Is it fly? Or are you just wearing a billboard? Close down, goes in depth. Death? 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 Which one is it? Close down, they're, they're doing the story. Ah. Get it right, guys. Get it right. My whole thing about the monogram trend is like, okay, I get it. A lot of monograms, it's classic. You know, the Gucci monogram, the Louis Vuitton monogram. I get it, it's classic. But you don't have to have everything on to go along with a monogram. Like if you got a monogram jacket, you don't have to have the shoes as monogrammed out. You don't have to have the belt that's monogrammed out. You don't have to have the hat that's monogrammed out. Like for what? You 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 look like a NASCAR. Being a billboard, you know. With a bunch of labels on. You look like a label. Like, I've seen people that had Fendi with the Fendi S. I had Fendi this. Then they had the Louis Vuitton belt. Gucci that. And then they had to hold a Gucci jacket just to show. I like to advertise that I spent my whole paycheck and some. That they got all their stuff from Chinatown, clearly. You know, they ain't pay all that bread for it. Because half of that stuff don't really exist, but whatever. This is fake. It's fake. Like when I see um, people with all these brands and showing them, hey, I'm here, I think of, hey, I'm a life being of Las Vegas. Like, I'm a liquor whore. Well, basically, that's, yeah, you're, you're, like, I'm actually correct about that. Las Vegas, whores come from Las Vegas, yeah. Like that. You whore! You know what I'm saying? But I get the whole monogram thing. It's cool, you know, when 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 you make it, it's like, oh, I got money now, so let me buy something to scream that, hey, I spent money on this. You don't have to. So it's a little wrong step for you guys. Uh, well, because one, why brand yourself like that? You know, like, you look stupid. Everyone else thinks you look stupid. God thinks you look stupid. Stop it. I mean, I get it. Fashion is supposed to be like, you know, I'm, uh, I'm out there and whatever. But for me, like, if we're gonna have like something Gucci, I'll have, I'll probably have like something like, like the latest Gucci double G Gucci belt, and that's it. Did I mention how much I hate double G Gucci belts? It'll be like very discreet. It'll be the only staple piece that I have that's like branded out there and then I'll have everything simple. Like, I, you really don't. You can get a solid color Gucci shirt and it might say Gucci small somewhere. I don't know. That's just as dope. But no, gotta be flashy, right? 
I get it. I get it. Nah, I don't. I'm lying. I don't. There you have it, folks. If you're learning anything from tonight's episode, ask yourself this. Would you rather spend to be a part of a trend, or would you rather save and start your own wave? I'm Brian Gumbo. This has been In a Timely Fashion. I'm out! Look, my uncle told me if you love him, then take your timing And learn the difference from a zirconia to a diamond I admit I kind of caught the buzz This shit ain't what I thought it was So why do fools fall in love? Feeling like Frankie Lime and they like Bishop, Bishop, give me one more pass I'm like, no doubt it's cool, just give me one more smash I'm telling you what I want and here they come more mad They like Javon, you're a dick, but then you come more fat I'm saying, it's such a beautiful cycle when I massage you But then you go from I really like you to Throwing titles, a thought of me being fully yours. I know that incites you. You show a heart that's big enough for them to put a knife through. So don't be shopping for layaways at David Bridal. These women, the man eaters, I peeped that they made for primal. I swear I was a good man before, hand on the Bible. They say love don't cost a thing. It's funny how things surprise you. Nah, cause I know I gotta find a love of my own. Cause I know. I gotta find a love of my own Cause I know I gotta find a love